So we're starting with Sirius here, right. and indeed it... We are not sponsored by Pringles. No, Otherwise, no, I would not no, have said not. that it was kind of bad. <laughs> 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 All right. Anyway, Sirius and Inza are oh, going I'm with Ranger. Serious, yeah, go. they are going with Ranger and Galena, while Shrawn and Litz are going with Strog and Galena. This pretty much gets a first blood, but Shrawn ties it up. Even goes to the lead after that nice battle. It goes for the uh, the whole team kill there. Oh, oh nice so accurate LG. Oh, nice finisher and with the... And perfect use of the drone as well. Yeah. Although I think he could have done the same thing with a single good rocket. Does not smile upon you. Throwing that drone in the way, in the path. And is here only relying with the... Uh, bubbles and the totem, basically. And all he has is just health, no armor. Only one armor shard. Picked from Shron's corpse, and Litz will be just uh, taking him down. Five seconds until Meg, in fact, even less for a heavy. Oh my the goodness! Yeah. But yeah, you can see both of these teams playing a Galena. Mm -hmm. That is a very common pick on Corrupted Keep in order to control that top of LG. Prevent people from pushing in, like this drone is right now. Oh, that was a that was a nice push from Zron and this there coming from both sides. Uh, really, it's gonna feel like three players pushing with that drone. Yeah, in fact, it was very sensible to uh, push with the drone as uh, Shwan just heard. Uh, oh my goodness! What's in Zron's hand? Uh, yeah. yeah, in Zron's hands now. But yeah, as, as Ron heard, oh, no. is just put that totem there. He just wanted to go with the uh, the peeker, just to destroy first and then go by himself. Oh, the nice push with the shotgun. He's got the strong end to get his stack back up very quickly. Like, he ate a lot of nails there flying in because he needed multiple uh, shotgun shots to kill his opponents there. But uh, the strong end instantly reset whatever progress they had done on his health. Both serious. items are in sync right now. Yeah, pretty much a half a second. Now, even more thanks to them. Uh, or thanks to Shrawn and Liz picking it up a little later. Shrawn uh, basically is getting. Uh, I would say a free mega, but still like free overheals thanks to his uh, passive. After just killing an opponent, picking up the uh, destroying cell. Oh, Apparently just healing from the totem, but it's oh, not enough for Sirius's LG. And it, he surely will take down Shron with him as well. That was really nice to see him getting that uh, really nice LG string and stepping to the side into cover the exact moment that he kills his opponent. Oh my Not God. being out there for a millisecond longer yeah. than it needs to be. It ends. Getting the double kill here with rockets. Yeah, indeed. Another team kill. Though again, he has no armor whatsoever, but still manages to uh, be Tron here, who is actually not concentrating on ends at all. Two seconds to heavy. Nice rocket on that. Uh, Let's here, who does grab the heavy, but in fact goes down with it. So I'm putting the LG back now. Only at 77 health. Just waiting for the t protection here. Trump will be picking it up. With Eight three. Stacked. Yeah. Eight stacked. Heating up a little bit here. Oh. 20 still not enough to run a, to do a proper prod run. Ince actually gets the kill. As Sirius picks up the protection. Over there, nail gun room now, he's healthy. Gonna lead to a much better run. Oh, what was that? That was Shron pretty much just pushing yes. with the LG. Let's see, Shron now in a very nice stack. I don't know if he actually picked Mega here, but... Even if he just didn't... That... Yeah. Yeah, sorry. I was just surprised that... Um... Instant react there when he was getting shot. Yeah. Please read chat, says Bagel. Oh. I guess 47 in Kabali 47 is representative of the sheer amount of oh my god, he dishes out. Is that what you. <laughs> is that an extremely important message that you needed me to see, Bagel? <laughs> nah, that name has been like even with the number, it has been for a while before I even decided to cast, but. Hmm. Maybe it is. 
Maybe it's a self-fulfilling prophecy like that. Yeah. Oh my goodness, it is 16 HP. Pushes in with the LG. Now he's very low on the ammo. And only going in with the starting machine gun. Now let's barely survive in that double kill there. 2 HP. Give the armor to uh, the Shron here. Pushes in a little bit after him now. It's just awkward when you only have a rocket and you're at the low ground like this. Gonna try to push up the jump pad together. It's always difficult. This is trying to do this all like always pushing from another angle than his teammate but recently it's just been leading to him not being ready for the fight hmm. like it takes too it takes too long for him to get around sometimes sorry that time Sirius is getting the quad because of that fight oh. that frags are tied up or kill that's always nice with quads Back. There's not exactly where this is hiding, but misses the most important shotgun shot there. Yeah, I just can't just believe. Takes him off him, but there wasn't enough time left on it anymore. I mean, quad damage makes pretty much any of your weapons deadly enough. Like you don't even need the unholy trinity to uh, to deal damage with it. And Sirius even proved it. He didn't even use the LG much. One HP on. Let's. After those rockets by Sirius, now barely getting the health from the totem. Getting pushed by Sirius now on spawn. And he has the uh, the starting shotgun here, trying to push Ron here, but Ron pretty much evens it out. Gets the point blank. Yeah, point blank, and gets the armor as well. Yeah, it was it was a really nice and big flick too, because that orb landed just behind him. But yeah, he just hits it perfectly. Oh, I don't know if that. Yeah. That was still, that was still quite a bit of self damage though. Yeah, I was, I was kind of wondering if, uh, if the uh, the drone actually hit or if it was the self damage uh, from no, the it, rocket. That was self damage because right. we saw the damage number that he had hit a hundred oh, damage. Oh yeah, I see, yeah, I see, yeah. Otherwise, it would have destructed itself, and you can't do damage to it then. Oh. Uh, it's rockets as he drops down. Five health remaining though, he actually suicides. I think that was on purpose so that he gets a spawning stack for this power up. Yeah, he that's... decides it would have taken too long to get a stack back in those 10 seconds. Is it already backed out to seven though? He's trying to Ooh. deal some damage on it. Sirius has it. And 124 stack. That's enough to run a good prot. Oh Shining my this goodness! Up. So nice! What rockets! Indeed, Sirius only has to stand still and look at perfect angles for those rockets, and eventually oh. he does go down. Yeah, he got, he got focused down really hard there in the air guard room. Yeah. Eans has the product here. So just bounced over to him. He's uh, just gonna run for health in the last couple seconds as it went. They've taken a three la three, sorry. Three frag lead, that is quite hard to say to me. Uh, with that power up, Zrond hitting the mid range rocket, nice. Yeah, and as it's you already, see that. Back down to one. Yeah, two seconds later, after saying that, it's a one frag lead, really, it's a very tight game. Yeah, Shron. But the thing is, before that, Zron and uh, Litz had had the lead for quite some time. Yeah. It wasn't a big lead, but it was constantly there. Uh, now for the first time it's undone with only 8 frags to go before the match ends. At the same time only 9 for Zron. No. Oh. Team killed by Sirius. He certainly is super good with the rockets as well. While people just praise Sirius' LG is super good then the rockets. Sure enough just do their job. Yeah, They've been winning these 2v2 fights here without any casualties? Oh. I was say that finally he goes down after this is at 12 health and hits a good rocket. But uh, yeah, that was another another team fight going entirely in the favor of Sirius and Inns, who are now three frags away from winning this. Whereas Zron and Lith need six, but they've got the quad, so that's gonna make it a lot easier. Five to go. Trying to bait this this mega maybe wasn't quite necessary. Yeah, they sure Next did kill is gonna tie up the frags. Hmm. Oh, just misses him. 
Oh, the teleport exit though. That's the armor for it. He's not oh. gonna die that soon. T team's tied with three frags to go. It's gonna be an extremely close one. The lead is back in the hands of Zrons, uh, Zrons and Lith, apparently. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna call him from now on. It's tied again as Sirius got the kill, right, as Quad wore off. So, uh, yeah. Next team to wipe loses the game. How are they gonna do this? Zron actually going in pretty alone over here. That could be dangerous, but he's not taking much damage for it. Going in with the drone now. Does hit it. Sirius goes down. One more kill for Zron and Lith. And they actually... Did it. Well, if we just call the uh, the last game the closest one, this surely enough beats it. My goodness. Yeah. So uh, that puts us at 1 1 total map score Ooh. since Sirius and Ains were coming from the upper bracket. Yeah. They got an advantage for it, and yeah. that has now been undone. Yeah, it sure is. So we're actually seeing three maps in yes, the grand from final. From here on out. At least. At least, yeah. From here on out, you can basically treat it like a best of three. Mm. Best of three, that's starting now. So what they did just now, as as close and uh, heart-stopping as that action was, it was still just what they needed to uh, tie it up. Just to mm. undo uh, their loss from earlier in the tournament, from back from round one. Holy crap. So after, after all that hard work, just to... Bring it back to an equal standing. But let's see, maybe they can they can use their momentum to keep going. Next map is Yeah, in fact Blood it is Blood Run and uh, yeah. just a reminder that uh, Corrupted Key was actually picked by Inns or uh, Team Kefla. Oh yeah. So they just lost their barely lost their old map here. But the next one we'll see is Blood Run, which is clearly favored, at least in this tournament, by uh Schwan and Litz. Are they ready once again? Yeah, it sure is very important. And ah, they are ready. Gear of reporting. Ready, comrade. Yeah, Champ also says first game very important for them. That's right. Sure if that is. had gone the other way, just in the last two frags, if that had gone the other way, <clears throat> Litson's uh, run would not have been out yet, but they would have needed to win all three remaining maps in a row yeah. without dropping anything. And that is just so much harder than the position that they've put themselves, put themselves in now. So that was a very important victory to get there. And I think we might actually be on track to see our first... Uh, lower bracket winner, as in uh, someone who wins the tournament despite coming through the lower bracket. A uh, bit of an underdog story. We have not had that yet in the Rocket Jump Zone Cups. Not in the League no. Duel, not in Rookie Duel, not in the other 2v2 Cup that we yeah, had. Yeah, pretty much not. It would be the first time if we get it here. In fact, I think we have had a game where uh, the maps were pretty much 3-1, three, uh, three, I guess. But, like, not 3-2, not let's just say that at least, yeah. Prepare your team. So, if Sirius and Inns manage to uh, beat uh, Schwanz and Litz's map here, three, two, it will be uh, one. Fight. time for, uh, boy, let's see. Yeah, like either way, if, like after this map, it will be time for the, uh, oh! the map after that. Oh my goodness. That homing rocket drone there. And a clean rocket to kill Sirius as well. Schwan. Teams are tied. Schwan only has four rockets now, trying to make, make some blind fire of him. Oh, like, yes. He's been missing a lot here. Yeah, All indeed. Rockets, that, except for that one. That direct right there. To make it up. Oh, and even the And grail. he's back on. Yeah. Back in track. All he was really missing was just the uh, the start here. Teams are tied. Oh, serious. Giving up the intel to Shron and Litz with the totem here. Oh, my goodness. The travel by Shron here. Sirius gets him on spawn. Now it's Sirius' turn to 
missed some pretty hittable rails. Does actually lose the LG versus LG fight because he was kind of pinned in a, in a spot where you couldn't have enough space to dodge around. This one the fight with 60 health remaining. Gets another kill here. Oh, and barely gets the trade as well, yeah. This operation is falling apart. Quad spawned. Enemy has the quad. It's a quad in the hands of Zdron. He's moving up over platform now. Drops down, gets that kill cleanly. Oh. Serious hitting really Why? big though. Oh, close like, rail. Super close oh, rails. In fact, Shron's still keeping it up with the protection. Oh my goodness, he's trying to make a surprise call out of the corner. Yeah, that might have been a bit too desperate. It sure was a little too desperate. Now yeah, they Shron... got a little ser serious, got decently close to killing that. Yeah. Uh, that struggle right there. Problem is, as soon as he gets those kills, and he's going to get a lot with Quad, he gets destroyed and he gets his stack back up without needing to go anywhere else. Ho oh, oh. ho. The accuracy well, fight. That he would drop down. Yeah. Let's hear only using pretty much the uh, the shotgun. Let's see, is now spawning right next to it. This is starting off to be a sizable lead for uh, Strawn and Litz. Oh, it's a dream fight for Inns here. Strawn barely using the drone there. And getting a. Uh, Immobilized it himself. Let's see, is now. I don't know which one actually had the timing for Mega, but that one is pretty much gonna be revoked by Shron's rail here. But it will be a kill for Inns. Yeah, you can't keep fighting at such close range with a rail. Inns yeah. just had a super easy time hitting those rockets there. Mm. Although I, I don't know if he knew, but like his was still pretty much available, so I guess he just wanted to give it another go. And Shron taking care of the whole power up area, picking the protection himself right before that, getting and a double more. kill. Once more, Shron with the power up. Oh, oh risky rails! You have the shotgun. Oh, oh no! Faster on the trigger. He was eight health as well, actually. Yeah. They were both super low there. Just Risky faster. rails. That, that was only, trigger finger. Yeah. In fact, that was only like a five meter range to uh, to serious there. All oh, the tribal chip damage. Oh, heavy will be up actually. Shron rocket jumping to it, getting some damage by Sirius's rails, but Shron just doing a nice sar bomba down. Oh. Barely hearing Inz's footsteps there, especially the weapon pickup. Now Inz will be just going down himself. Yeah, that was well played just to get a get a trade out of that. Could have very easily just been a one-sided kill. Oh. Oh, but he but he hits the drone shots decently well. Sure Almost did. as good as a nail gun. Strong with one HP only after that one rail. It was barely not railable, but oh, oh my goodness! Oh, nice. Oh! Pounding rockets, that's what I like, especially like him direct and another oh, one by another Inns. Inns, like I'm not sure if we're watching live gameplay or uh, a frag montage from Inns right now. That was two in a row, just as beautiful <laughs> as they could be. Top that up with a mid air rocket. And with that, the frags are tied up. Oh, oh. Failing the rocket jump, unfortunately, and has to die for it. So not immediately there to punish. Oh, this quad's gonna go to Sirius and Inns, though. I don't that know which one it will be. be. Them taking the lead for the first time. Oh, let's do the spam. And Shron actually does get the, uh, the power up from uh, Sirius now. Oh yeah, very well played. Backstrong will be just saving the day from Sirius and let's fight here. Oh my goodness, the rocket spy ends. Oh, everything hits right now for him. But uh, not hard enough to beat a fully stacked quad carrier. Yeah. That might have been asking too much. 
The items won't be spawning in just a while, and Shrine is super low, eventually going down to Sirius's nails here. The nail gun usage on this map is just something else. We saw it on the first time they were playing on this map, and lit barely 3 HP right after that. Yeah. That is that is the most health you can have if you win an LG versus LG yeah, fight against Sirius. It worked out for him here. Ooh, oh, Sirius coming in perfectly. That's proper teamwork. Two angles on the same guy, probably getting called out with the right weapon. And this is not quite his teamwork here with Strong mistiming the Mega. Kind of stepping off a bit too early. Oof. See, it's only, I think he just barely spawned. Got the uh, the rocket and the rail. Heavy won't be spawning in just a while, but they are still uh, holding the uh, <coughs> troubled area. Oh. oh clean rockets. Especially, it up. Yeah, especially you when you're just a meter, meter away from your opponent and another one, the same style. Just a centimeter away from your opponent this time. Uh, 10 health prot is not really worth anything anyway. Oh, and he didn't even <laughs> notice Lith's behind me, yeah. yeah. Be behind his... Ooh. Oh, one good rocket, but it's gonna need more. He's whiffing all the other ones. <laughs> How is he still surviving these? Although he does have the protection, but that already felt like a lot of damage since the uh, the hits. Really oh, actually using his last last two rockets, one for the rocket jump, one for the kill. Very efficient. Oh, nice! Once more on six health. It's just so able to win these fights that come down to the final shot like that, and. They have been rewarded with a 7 frag lead so far. Sirius comes in there. It's, uh, out of ammo lifts. Not able to answer with anything. Oh, that's a bad spawn for Zron. Oh, Can't man. do anything with that. Wouldn't even really answer with any damage. Sirius still overstacked on both health and armor. Those rockets could be a little better, but uh, it's, uh, it's an awkwardly shaped floor there. Yeah, in fact, I don't know what that rocket jump was. He just hit the, uh, the doorway ceiling there. That was something else. I think he was just uh, not anticipating the... Uh... The do doorway just coming in his way while he was trying to rocket jump up to rocket. Now he just needs more of him. Well, let's kind of trap there, but Strong comes to save the day. Sirius barely escaping the scene with the uh, <laughs> teleporter. Yeah, when that happens to your drone, you know not to take the teleporter after it. Yeah. These sudden teleporter appearances make me just think that I, I thought Doom 3 was scary enough, but this game just sometimes spooks you. Unexpected pushes and everything. Alright, time for the next quad. Looks like it'll go to Sirius. Got about a hundred stacks, should be enough to run this well. Oh. Oh, I think he, Sron just barely got the intel. It's just going down the LG, but Sirius here. With the quad damage, even with the Dire Warp, is just definitely deadlier. Yeah, every power up, every power up Sirius and Insta to catch up again. But there's still two frags to go. Oh, nice one. Oh, Sron had no Make way that to one. Yeah. Make that zero. They're tied up. Oh, yeah, indeed. Eight. First team to get eight frags from now on takes the map lead. As in, in the series. Oh. Just a little safety spam, and then it turns out to have actually worked. Nice oh, rockets, the clean. rockets, yeah. It's only a frag lead. They're already making the uh, the closest of the games here. Oh, the LG by Sirius on Lit Series. Barely finishing him and Shrawn up. I think he's barely just noticed that there's the uh, the totem. He just has to remember not to walk into it. I don't know if he actually has seen the rest of. <laughs> um, yeah, let's yeah, see, let's just totems. Means, uh, that means Ron and Litz have overheal totems right now. Yeah. Flaming totems. And off the back of those, they took the frag lead once more. Four to go to win the map. Ins ties it up, but 
with 20 health remaining. He's got his got totems of his own. Oh, it's really getting very close. Like. Protection. Yeah, that's what we like to see. Oh, that rocket, oh, that low ground the... rocket just barely going past his feet. Yeah. Two frag leaders run and Lith to uh, have the better position for this power up as well. As Sirius just running in, does a lot of damage. Ince cleans it up. That's still one more kill and protection for Zron and Liths. Trying to find it down there. Oh, yeah, and there it it's pretty much there. Oh my goodness. So once more, we've had a 50 to 48 and now we have a 50 to 47. But both times it went to Zron and Liths, making it 2 to 1 in the series. If they can win this next map, if they can win either of the next two maps, they are the second rocket jump zone 2v2 champions yes in fact like the lower bracket or the losers bracket uh, players or the team this is now the uh, the first time that Shron and Litz has actually done that like two maps as the other uh, losers bracket players in the grand finals so nobody else has actually uh, been able to uh, put it up to two maps it's two to one to uh, Shron and Litz here. And the next map we will be seeing is Blood Covenant. No, Ruins of Stana. Oh, sorry, sorry. Blood Covenant, yeah, I was just, Blood like, Covenant thinking... will only be played if we go to the very final decider map. I see, and I'll I be see. honest, I would not be surprised if oh, that happens. Oh. These teams have been so unbelievably close this entire series. I couldn't agree more. Worst Ruins, there it is. See, 50 and 15. I just like randomly switched the mode by accident. Alright, let's see. I think we're just pretty much ready. The Ruins of Sarnath, pretty much the third map we're seeing already. And it's 2 to 1 to Shron and Litz. They are the uh, pretty much the first players to, uh, to score 2. In the grand final as the lo loser's bracket players, yeah. So Sirius and Ince technically haven't scored a single point with the maps other than just winning the winner bracket, of course. So it is 2-1. to one. Ruins of Sana, that it was Ince's and uh, Sirius's pick. Yeah, but it wasn't their first pick. I think if you no. really have the map that you feel super awesome on, it's what you pick first. And they actually lost their first choice. Yeah, I was just about to say that was a... Uh, probably but, can I mean, be a huge impact to that. Instant seriously here. Yeah, I want to say that's a, that's a... A big hit to take, to lose mm. your first picked map. But the fact is, it was 50 to 48. It could have absolutely swung either way. Yeah. Just like Nudrum could have swung either way. So, uh, <laughs> I don't think that's an omen of things to come. I think this is going to be a very unpredictable game. It's nice that at least Composition B in the chat heard I said Sarbomba. I just called some, uh, <laughs> uh, let's just say, uh, high ground rockets done down by uh, by Russians. I called them oh, Sarbombas. <laughs> Shron pretty much, oh my goodness, oh, we're yeah. starting with Shron actually, so. He's yeah, it's got perfectly pinned there as if the, as if the ground extended, but really it was just serious as in uh, LG. Oh my goodness. He's gonna have to run in with a starting shotgun. Never mind, Sirius finds the pixel rail. Did we just team a bit alone right now though? Ah, oh, it's not a real fight, it's just... The He's spamming yeah. at the entrance. Just pretty much giving the heavy to Sirius here. Oh, the LG. By Sirius and the reels right behind the corners. Can he barely hit this one? He's trying to hit the totem instead, but barely lands the rail on Let's and nice. nice orb. Right after now, it's just super low on health. Oh, Shron utilizing that wall there pretty nicely. Uh, unfortunately, his run didn't hit. If he had hit just one rail, it would have been a kill there. So it was 15 health and some armor. 
Nice hit there. Incoming Denying the armor. I'm pretty sure this ain't the first time some player has actually utilized that wall there after the March patch. Since there's no uh, no more invisible wall there. Sirius is up 5 0. All the kills of his team were him. Six and he has no time. Make that 6, much. but he does <laughs> let Litz have that quad. The 1v2 is too hard for that. <clears throat> get, finally gets taken out. Let's see what Litz can do with it. Gonna have to drop down at some point, since he can probably predict that his opponents will not be showing their face up here. I can't find him. There we go. I'm gonna be taking the jump pad straight into them. Oh, oh my goodness. The PM gauntlet. Tie it up, 7-7. Seven, seven. Yeah, Litz had many, many angles to look at there, and he didn't look at just the uh, the most dangerous one where Inz was just there and he just railed him down. But now let's grabbing the heavy. Barely surviving the uh, the machine getting of Inz here, but 24 HP will be uh, pushed by Sirius here this time. Just doing the totem. Oh, oh my goodness, the rails, especially the flex by Sirius. He's, he's using his orb perfectly to get as much bonus damage in between his shots as possible. Yeah. In that fight, it really made the exact difference that he needed to get the kill. Because he was left on like 15 health. Mm. Right, so for the first time, we have an early lead to Sirius and Inns. They had, they had always been behind at the beginning of the other two maps. Mm. So low and waiting for the heavy a little too early here. And uh, will be picked up by Strawn. Let's now having no rockets, but some decently accurate LG, but Sirius yeah. with 5 HP. Yeah, that rail at the end, that hit. And it got him down so low. My oh, he's not there in time for protection though. That's the downside of going low there. Yeah, Zron actually not taking oh, this oh, oh. nice rocket. He's not taking this uh, power up run too aggressively there at the beginning because he was too low. He needed yeah. stack first, and once more he's down to 50. That is quite beatable. And in a 2v1, he can close that up easily. Yeah, still pretty much beatable. But I was surprised. Let's actually survive that. Oh, there we go. Now he went down. But like he survived that uh, rocket by uh, Inz there. Since we're, he was pretty much just uh, cornered. Eventually doing some nice couple rockets there. Mid-airing him. Alright, Strawn again getting the heavy here. Getting damaged by a lot. Yeah, last rocket used. So he's forced to use rail here now. Oh, oh and he gets the totem and gets... <laughs> yeah, he gets blocked by uh, Strawn here. Huh? Yeah. Sorry. He was still pushing at four health with yeah. his close range rail against the stacked Zron. It's like, please, Sirius, you gotta stop at some point. I cannot believe. Oh, now Sirius gets the uh, the armor this time. Yeah, off the back of that armor. It's just still, ever so slightly fast to it. Yeah, but still gonna get revoked by, first of all, Strong's damage, and now Litz will be finishing him up. Oh, actually the LG will just... Oh, I didn't know it, if he actually saw Sirius there, but he was just not firing at him, so... That wall can be very deadly now. Shaw barely going down to Insta's MG here. Getting the rail, and now landing one on Let's. Let's now low on LG. They're waiting for Quad here, which will be spawning right now. Oh, he does nice. get it. Immediately hitting the rail. So not a hundred, any chance. 100 stack here, now even lower thanks to the rail. Yeah, but he's got the bubbles, he's got the totems, and he's got the small armor. So he's back up to something fight worthy very quickly. Just wants to get some LG ammo. I think he should be hurrying a bit more to find these kills because he has the advantage now. He could have gotten more out of that run. Does actually give it to Inns at the end, but it's about to run out. Hmm. Two 
Easy. Oh my goodness. So far, looking at the score even, it again is pretty much tied at 24-26 with Jastron and Litz leading with only two. Yeah, and it may be a small lead, but you gotta keep in mind, Zron and Litz are on match point. If they do win it, oh, yes. no matter how small it is, the series is over and they win. Hmm. Sirius and Inns, meanwhile, they need to win this map to even just take it to the final decider one, which would be Blood Covenant. Oh, Inns playing this so well. Constantly ducking back into cover, fighting both at the same time. It's not quite good enough at the end. He's whiffing the important shots, but... Uh, he certainly survived longer than most would have in that 1v2. Oh, oh no, that oh rocket! My goodness. I can't believe that hit. Indeed, he just. Oh my goodness. Sirius just aligned like a star to that rocket right there. Brilliant. Oh. Incoming protection. Will be protection. Yeah, it gets quiet. Yeah. It gets quiet in preparation for prot. Sure will be. Looks like it'll go to Sirius. But he's not that <laughs> stacked. Got the totem for him. Teams are tied. Leave taken. Alright. Both of his opponents have been called, so he should know where to go. Confrontation at the top of the big pad. Sirius does get it. Oh, oh my goodness, what rockets by Shron here. Sirius. Yeah, put him all the way down to 34 health. So, uh, just a little bit more, just one more. Well, if he had hit another direct rocket, he would have still needed an extra hit, but you know, he was damn close to taking that protection off of him. Oh, and look at those nails, My beautiful. Goodness. And with all the Stroyant there, look at his stack. He's immortal for a couple yeah, seconds now. He almost now. was like <coughs> carrying the mega health. And they, oh my goodness, he's at 9 HP. They almost got through it. Wow. It was so much. He needed every single bit of that gigantic stack. Oh, but seriously, you're making the push for it. Oh, Both are going super close with rails. I don't know if either one. Oh, there we go. Both had stunning shotguns, but Sirius ending the fight there with the rail had landing. The next one's as well, Shron. Going down once again from spawn. How is Sirius doing these? Oh! Sean, what is this? Oh, oh no, my goodness, he, no! Just the angle, Sean barely just trying to save with the trade, but Blitz is already pretty much dead. I think, I think it was just trying to peek enough over the edge to be able to shoot a rocket straight down. Yeah. But that also meant that he was able to get LG'd from down there, and that's gonna lift him up and away from the edge. Need some nice LG accuracy by Shron. He barely misses the rail on the doorway. But landed the second one. Just not sure what weapon to use there, LG. With... And nine frags up. I oh. think I think we gotta pay attention to that. Four more frags. Indeed for they are. The timer. And Zron and Liz might be about to win this tournament from the lower bracket. And if you see that. Grand final. Three more kills. If you're seeing that too early here, oh my goodness, Inns! Yeah, you don't want to jinx it with Caster's Curse, but uh, getting 10 kills before your opponents can get 3, it's very difficult, especially if your opponents are Zron and Litz. Well, they already have gun 3, and it's a 7 frag difference here. I don't know if they just barely realized that. Inns and Sirius here, I mean. Oh, the rockets barely missing by the Litz. Getting the last one hit. They're very close now. He's gotta wipe to the play. enemy team one more time. Yeah, indeed. And they can afford to die at it. They've got a sizable lead for the standards of this super close series. Ooh. There's one more. And there, and it, there is. it is. Blitz and Shron, the champions of this tournament. Oh my goodness. Hon. 40 and 50. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Like, I don't oh, know. I've, I've been saying it wrong the whole time, Hon. too. I'm st it's starting to just become a running Hon. gag. That nobody says it right. 